So my hair has already been washed, already been conditioned, deep conditioned, and twisted up. The products that I use to twist up my hair is why I want to kind of give a review on today. This is the Unky Funky's Daughter Thirsty Curls. And of course, I use my trusty Jamaican black castor oil, and this is the mango and lime version. This has vitamins A, D, and E in it, and it moisturizes, softens the hair, and it's a very good. It treats dry nails and hair, and it's also great for the skin. So go and get you some Jamaican black castor oil. You will not be disappointed. So these are the two products. Just trying something different to see how well my curls are gonna pop with these products. Again, my hair has already been washed, already been uh, detangled, washed, conditioned, and twisted for the night. I twisted it using only these two products. This is a leave-in, the Uncle Funky's Daughter uh, Thirsty Curl Leave-In. I'm not sure if that's gonna focus, but I use this and sealed with my Jamaican Black Castor Oil. So we're gonna do a takedown and see how this looks. My hair has dried overnight. And we're gonna see how it looks. Let's just see if we can get a close up and see if the twists still look kind of moisturized. Yeah, I'd say they're pretty moisturized. They still feel slightly, in some areas, slightly damp, but that's okay. We're gonna take it down and see how it goes. So, yeah. Um, I did do a leave-in conditioner. Uh, I don't have it on hand, but I did my Cantu Shea Butter leave-in conditioner uh, before I let the hair dry. So, Uncle Funky's with the Shea Butter leave-in conditioner, Cantu Butter, and this to seal. So here we go. We're gonna take this down and see how it goes. something about this again this video is not sponsored I don't think I said that in the beginning no I didn't this video is not sponsored um, I just wanted to try I ran across this in Target and I said I've been hearing a little bit about Uncle, Uncle Funky's daughter funny name my sister and I laughed about this name actually but I've been hearing a lot of rave reviews from some naturals about this product so I wanted to try it and um, give it a try and see how it worked for my hair the Jamaican black castor oil is a long time staple in my hair regimen. Um, guys, if you want to grow back ball patches or thicken your hair, grow your hair, and just make your hair overall healthy, again, this particular brand is great for the skin as well. I also use black seed oil. I use frankincense oil for my skin, but that's a whole other video. But um, yeah, get you some black Jamaican black castor oils. I can't tell you how many times I have a lot of naturals who say, how do I grow my hair? How do I thicken my hair? It's going to take um, help, of course, from the inside out and things like Jamaican black castor oil or castor oil. If you can't get the Jamaican black, then you can get any type of um, good natural organic castor oil for your hair. So yeah, let's get going. <laughs>
gone through and unraveled every single twist. You have to kind of search down in there and make sure there are no more twists. See? There you go. That happens. When you've got a lot of hair and a lot of mini twists, you will lose your twists in the mix. So you got to go in there and search for other twists. So now, I think I've gotten all of them. Once you've done that, what you want to go in and do, this is very important, guys. Now, some people would like to rock with their hair like this. Just this texture um, with the twist unraveled one time, and maybe they want to put it up in a cute little um, side swoop like this, or maybe they want to just put it up in a bun with the texture still like this, but I like big hair. I'm extra, so yeah, I like big hair. So I like to go in, take these twists, and unravel them a second time, maybe even a third time, and take a pick to them and fluff out my fro. So let's do that and see how this goes. to its desired um, bigness. <laughs> if you want big hair, you just kind of have to pull on it. And because these defined curls are really tightly coiled and it's gonna take at least a day or two for your hair to really just puff out if you, if you like big hair. If you don't, if you like the um, defined look, then that's fine. You can just rock with it like this. But I like to keep pulling on mine and I take my comb and kind of lift the roots a little to get a little lift at the base. Don't comb all the way through, of course. And um, that's pretty much the style that I like to go for. You can take a little edge control here. And you just keep pulling on it until it's the way you want. And rock with it. But overall, let's get my argan oil extra hold, perfect edges, perfect edges. I'm not so sure about that in my case because me and my edges struggle big time. So yeah, trusty old toothbrush. Kind of get those edges a little uniformed. There. Again, the part, you may want to wear your part on the right or on the left. It's just preference, that's all. It doesn't have to be perfect. And yeah. Now, I could have kept my hair like this with the part somewhat in the middle and just have a big bushy, um, big bushy type curly fro, which is cool as well. But for this kind of defined hair, I kind of like to do it like this. So, yeah. So guys, overall, I give the Uncle Funky's Daughter Thirsty Curls Leave-In Curl Revitalizer in combination with sealing my hair with my trusty Jamaican black castor oil, I give that 
an 8 out of 10. A high 8 out of 10. Pretty good stuff. I want to try the rest of the products in this line as well because I know they have um, other products that actually go with this leave-in spray. But um, I'm loving how this looks for now. We'll see how it weathers throughout the day and the week. But yeah, style it, of course, with your earrings. This is NYX Liquid. And guys, you can't do a fall look, a true, true fall look without a bold burgundy or reddish lip. I don't have on make much makeup at all, but a bold lip for the fall with some nice fall colors. Yes, gotta do that. So 